Hello guys, this is JT Gravity RC. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how I'm going to put a higher capacity LiPo battery with a JST connector to the Zingling X163F. So, what you need to do is you need to have yourself made a connector like this from uh, using female JST connector you solder it on to the um, male low C connection and then you heat shrink them together the reason why I'm doing this is because when I bought this Zingling X163F and uh, when I got it yesterday uh, the battery capacity is really small which is 500 milliamps and I tried to find extra batteries on Banggood and uh, Gearbest I couldn't find 7.4 volt uh, lossy connector battery and even if I did find one I think it's for the DM007 the capacity is even lower than the ori original uh, battery for this quad so it's I think about 400 milliamps so I was thinking to myself since the JST connector is more common um, so why not I use my JJRC X1 1200 milliamps battery for um, this quad so I was looking around the um, Gearbest and Bango and I found a, con a wire similar to this but it's already made up so I'm going to put the link below my video so you can get, get it, get it uh, ready made or you can make one yourself by, by soldering these two connectors together if you have spare wires so this battery is a perfect fit for the Zingling uh, X163F I'll show you um, so you slide this in it's just right at the edge of the uh, uh, battery compartment so what you do is you connect the JST connector and then you connect the low C connector to the quad so then you then you just um, wrap wrap the uh, wires around and then slide this thing into the uh, compartment here. There's enough space to put the um, extra bits of wires. So maybe this way, so I don't break anything on the uh, control board. So. Have a look at that, it's a perfect fit. And uh, let me turn this on. And let me let me try to fly this. Have a look at this. Need to adjust my camera a bit. A bit higher. And get my controller. Sorry about that. I lost my orientation.
this car is pretty stable and it looks like the battery has the right amount of weight for this quad so I'm happy with this so um, that's it for this video um, as you can see you don't really need to turn on the uh, monitor if you want to turn on the monitor you just need to press the power button otherwise it can be off so to save you some battery so I was able to fly this without the monitor on so guys that's it for this video I hope you get something out of this and um, you can use this um, uh, idea for any other quads because uh, you know you have JSC connector which is very common with the lossy connector which is not common so anyway hope you guys enjoyed this video please like and subscribe to my channel I'll see you next time this is JT Gravity RC cheers